But often when things are at their worst, that's when we see the best in others. And one Arklatex neighborhood battered by barrel had to cope with debris blocking the streets and no power to their homes. But as Alden Moore explains, volunteers came out with not only food, but the strength to help clean up. Yeah, you live over here in the area? Negotiating through the Beverly community in Texarkana today was a challenge as downed trees and power lines hit by Monday's storm blocked many streets. I was here, I felt the roof lift up a little bit and I could, it just got black outside, saw a tree go by. It was terrible, mm -hmm. terrible, terrible. Texarkana, Texas work crews spent the day making roads passable. Several homes were damaged after trees fell on them, but authorities said no one was hurt. Dorothy Sims and her family were inside their home when two trees crashed down on their house, knocking a hole in the roof. Something was happening outside, and I said, I said, well, Lord, you ain't got to tell me twice. So I got up out of my bed and walked around, and then that's when we seen the tree on both sides. Had, it had hit both trees. Patricia Sims rode the storm out inside a closet. I went down like this, and I was just sitting there for about like five, ten minutes. People here are a part of the two million Texans without power. And so far, there's no word on when the electricity will be restored. Uh, but we're looking at about 9,000 unique repair locations all across the Arklatex. So we appreciate all of our customers' patience. Meanwhile, Harvest Regional Food Bank has teamed with the Beverly Community Center to provide food to those affected by the storm. And we're going to be passing out food and it's sponsored by Harvest Regional. And we are also here with uh, Mount Sinai House of Prayer, which, is all, which has a food ministry that comes out and helps us every week as well. We're told the groups will provide food as long as it's available. Members of the nonprofit organization Restoration of Hope, a group of men who serve time in jail, are cleaning up Beverly Park. Through our years of addiction and crime, we took a, a lot out of the community. And uh, we, just, we just think that it's a big deal to give back to the community every chance we get. In Texarkana, Texas, Alden Moore, KSLA News 12.